Hey guys, this is Julie. I heard a UPS truck and a little knock on my door and look what's here. It's my Stampin' Up! starter kit. Let's go take it inside and check out what I got. All right, so I'm gonna show you what I chose for my Stampin' Up! starter kit. I got to choose $125 in product, which was super fun and kind of hard to do because uh, <laughs> there's just so many good things. But the box was too big, so I just set it off to the side, and I'm just going to pull out the things. So this is my very first Stampin' Up! stamp set. Um, I have never had one before. And so this is my first one. I decided to go with a sentiment because you can't go wrong with a sentiment stamp set, right? So this one definitely I'm going to be using in the next few months on projects. Um, this one is called Simply Said, I believe. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna try it out and see how that goes. And if I have a stamp, I need some ink. So I got one of their ink pads. Um, this is Petunia Pop. It's one, what they call the in color. And it's one of those, and I got the Petunia Pop because it seemed to be darker than the others, so it might work really well with the sentiments. Um, and then I got, Two packages of the in color shimmer gems these are actually going to be a little gifty at my crop coming up because I wanted to share some of the love with um, the ladies that come to my crop so those are shimmer uh, gems and they have all the colors in them here I'm just gonna open them real fast here we go here we go Look how many come in a sheet. That's a really big sheet of gems. And I really like the size. They're not too big, not too small. Really nice size of gems. That's one thing about Stampin' Up! I'm super excited about. I was um, trying to pick out different accents to get because I love accents. So, um, oh, I did get... The 6x6 Designer Series Paper. They don't have this in 12x12, and maybe they do, and I just didn't see it. But I wanted to get different um, designs in that in color of the year. So I look, that's the Petunia Pop. It's going to take me a minute to get used to these different color names for sure. And then it looks like, oh, the other side has... Some different patterns so i thought that'd be really cute to use for cards or whatnot just to have some more different designs in that collection and then i've got what is called um ephemera pack i believe is how you say it and they don't have stampin up doesn't have sticker sheets like close to my heart so i got these with the intention of using these uh, instead of stickers so we'll see how that goes um, I have an idea but we'll see <laughs> like I said we'll see how it goes uh, these are just like die cuts but look how cute those are there's two sheets of each one. Oh, look at the little puppy and I think there's like three or four different packs of these different options oh the kitty that's for sure um, so those are the ephemera packs. Again, I'm gonna to try to maybe sneak some of those into some of our projects coming up. And then I got two, two packages of the in colors. Again, I'm going to share some of the love with those coming to my crop in May. Um, so act surprised. <laughs> and I have Lila, my kitty, she's helping me out. She might come join us here on the table. She's like, what is going on? So there's 12 by 12 pieces of cardstock. So, see, this kind of reminds me of Lagoon and we love Lagoon, right? And this kind of reminds me of Sundance. And that's for sure like a, yeah, that's just a really nice pink. Um, can't remember the name, close to my heart name right now. I'm kind of in a, trying to remember both names. So that is the In Colors cardstock. I got two packs of those. Um, 
What was I gonna say about that? Now I can't remember. Oh, it, they do have eight and a half by 11 in, on, in the cardstock. But I'm used to 12 by 12. Oh, Lila just knocked something over. I'm used to the 12 by 12, so I just grabbed the 12 by 12. All right. And I needed some pattern paper. It comes shrink wrapped. So I'm definitely going to need some of those paper um, paper bags that I have found on Amazon that I absolutely love. I'll put a link in the description of the video. They are so nice. Um, they are actually even better than Close to My Heart's zippered top bags. So definitely grab you some of those. So I think these are, yes, they are two-sided. So let me just flip these over real fast. These are in the, oh, look how cute. These are, oh, no, there we go. These are in the in colors. And I'm hoping to design a workshop around these for June. So stay tuned, more to come. And it looks like there's all those different patterns. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Is there 12? Hold on, I gotta let Lila out, she's meowing. Okay, so there's all these sheets that come in a pack. So this is called, uh, like I said, I'm gonna have a hard time remembering all these names, so bear with me. Unbounded Beauty Designer Series Paper. Okay. And then I got another pack that I hope to use in June that I thought was really pretty. These are all from the brand new annual idea book that will, will be coming out May 1st. And this one is called Country Woods. And let me go through and just show you. Well, that came out, oh, there we go. It like looked yellow for a minute. All the different colors and patterns. Oh, that's like a copper color. Very pretty. And then this last one right here. Oh, that's cute. That'd be so cute for like a beach. Okay, so that is, what did I say this was? Country Woods. <clears throat> there we go. So there's that one. I apologize for my voice. I'm still getting over my illness. <laughs> so, but I'm so excited to share all the fun things. Um, and then... This I'm so excited before. I've always kind of had FOMO, um, the fear of missing out, <laughs> when I see the paper pumpkin on line. I just always thought this subscription box was the cutest. So I'm excited to actually just open this up and see what's inside. I kind of always wanted one. Okay, so. We get a little stamp pad. This is Pebbled Path and a little stamp set. Has Hello Friend, um, a thousand good luck wishes, wishing you all the best with some flowers. And oh, we can try it, become a subscriber, and then you can invite other people to join. So this is a subscription and I'm learning. So hopefully I can share more information on that. Oh. There's tissue paper. This is fancy. I don't want to mess it up. Oh my goodness. So cute. Tissue paper. I love it. Okay, let's see if I can get this out of here. Okay, so it looks like it, it oh, here we go. It has nine yeah, it looks like nine cards and envelopes. Look how cute that is. And it has the stamp set. And I'm guessing this is adhesive or a ribbon. Oh my goodness, that is so cute. And then some of these little gems. Oh, okay, I'm so excited about that. If you have a paper pumpkin subscription, let me know. 
<laughs> because that is one of the things I'm so excited about. So you'll probably be seeing that a little bit more. And then um, I think the last thing I got that is fun, <laughs> other stuff is like catalogs, you know, um, is I had a little bit left. So I grabbed some of the Stampin' Dimensionals. I see these all the time on YouTube videos, other ladies using them. And so I grabbed some to try them out because I do love 3D foam. So awesome. Okay, so I'm so excited to be joining Stampin' Up! on May 1st. And stay tuned because I'm going to, now that I have all my goodies, I can start on uh, designing our workshop, um, our virtual craft day projects coming up in the next few months. So stay tuned. Um, and I will put a link um, to my new website in the description of the video. It'll be live May 1st. And then you can get grab all of these items too. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.